I have a box of things uh, set aside for future experimentation. Um, so I just pulled this this out. Thought I might just uh, have a quick look at this. So it's a, a backlight that's come out of some equipment. I can't remember what I took it out of, but it's a uh, it's um, LCD backlight. Um, so I thought I'd connect it up to some power. There's a couple of little connectors there for, um, I guess, well, I guess it needs th two or three volts for an LED, but let's, uh, let's have a go. So the first thing to try, I've got a little battery here, a CR2016. So first of all, I'll have a go with this, see if I can make it light with this. Yeah, there we go. So it's a blue backlight. Let's just switch off this light here. So if you can see it any better. Uh, there you go. So blue backlight. It's quite even. It's quite nice. Let's see if I can bring it a bit closer to the camera. I'm not sure if it's getting washed out by the auto exposure. But there you go, it's quite an even blue backlight. So that's that's pretty nice. So it'll run off three volts. Um I'll just connect up the bench power supply I guess and see how much current it draws. So I set this up for 2 volts maximum and 15 milliamps, so it's current limited. I can't remember which way around the battery went, but here we go. No, that way, maybe. Oh, it might actually need 3 volts. Let's, uh, Set that up. All right, three volts. Oh, there we go. Oh, it's very bright. Yes, that's current limiting, so that's actually using 15 milliamps. Oh, nice. So, I uh, don't know what I'm going to use it in, but it's just a little sort of uh, exploration of something that I've got uh, in my box of tricks. So having just finished describing this backlight, I discovered this one in the bottom of a box as well. So um, let's connect this one up. So I've still got the power supply, my bench supply, bench power supply is set up for three volts. Uh, we're set for 20 milliamps current limit. And we'll plug this one in also. This one's got some coloured wires on it, so it's easier to see which way around to connect it. So 
So this one's blue also. So we've got a blue backlight. Again, it's quite even. But it's not uh, current limiting, so I might just wind the current up a bit, see what happens. That's at 30 milliamps. Doesn't seem to be getting much brighter though. So I don't know, I don't want to blow it up, so I won't wind it all the way up, but but there we go, two blue blue LED backlights. Um, any, any ideas what you want me to use them for? So uh, any ideas about what to do with a blue backlight? Please put it in the comments below.